Hello boys and girls. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can share your work with another student if you're planning to work on Sway collaboratively. So what you want to do is first thing you want to go into Office 365 and log in. Please make sure that you're not doing it through the app. Then once you're there what you want to do is you want to click on Sway and then you want to take a look at your project. Please note that most of the time it will ask you to download the app. You may use the app if you're working on your own. However, if you're going to be working with other people, you will not you will actually work online. That's the best way to work in collaboration. Now, you obviously need to create a sway in order to be able to uh, work on one. So this I'm just going to call it test and what I will do is I will click sway and I will now be able to see right here on the left side the test assignment that I created. So what you want to do is you want to click on it and you want to be in the actual sway. Now let's say that this is the one I'm sharing with another person. What you want to do is you want to click share on the right side. Once you click on that you're going to notice that there is a URL there. Now please notice that it is it says view. And the first option right there it says invite people to view you would actually take that link and share it if you only want people to see your sway. If you want to share it with other people, if you want to demonstrate your presentation. However, if you want to collaborate with another person, you want to click edit. Once you click on that, do you notice that the URL changes? That's because this link right here is a link so that you can actually work with other people. So you want to click on the button right next to it on the right and it said it says copied but that means is that now you can paste that link and you can send it to the person you are collaborating with at this point i'm gonna open up go back to office 365 click on the outlook app which is the mail and once again you don't want to use the app now you notice right there and it's uh, telling me that i should use the app and i can open it but i don't recommend that the reason for that is because the app can be slower in sending emails and slower in receiving them. So you're better off working online. Here, I'm going to click the plus sign to send an email. And I'm going to start right here by actually pasting the URL. That URL will allow the person who see, clicks on it to edit it. Please be careful. If this link ends up anywhere, any person with that link can log in and change your project. Subject, Sway, and then here, we're gonna type the name of the person uh, that you're sending the email to. In this case, um, you wanna type their name, and if you don't see their name come up, you can click on search, and then that will very likely narrow it down to the person you're looking for. At this point, you may click that little button right there which will now send the email to the person and you're done now all they have to do when they get that email is click on it and start working on your project together i hope you found this tutorial helpful